What is going on, people inside the internet machine? Welcome to episode 73. So glad that you guys could be here. Uh, before we head out and do some game hunting, I usually like to, you know, I don't think I had any trades this week, but I like to throw in these little pre video videos before we go game hunting. Uh, more like updates or whatever. Like I said, I didn't have any trades or anything like that, any Craigslist or offer ups this time. But I did get this. I don't know if I shared that. I've had this for a while, though. I don't know if I shared it. But it's a uh, soft case. For my Omega Ruby uh, Nintendo 2DS that I got from Hamilton, which is pretty cool. Got, uh, okay, so here was the uh, Grandia game that I got from Nintendo 13 in our Ohio State Michigan bet. Um, I swapped it out for a nice clean case, so there we go. And there's his, uh, his note that was in there. That's pretty cool. And uh, yeah, we beat Uncharted, so awesome. I think that's it. Like I said, all right, let's get out there and let's go do our thing. As you can see, we had a very exciting day out there. Actually, we got some stuff. We got quite a bit of stuff. We didn't really get anything for the collection, though. We got, you know, quite a bit of stuff to resell, but that's okay. All this stuff turns into money that we can spend at CorksCon or something. So, all right. So, first thing that uh, I want to show you guys, pick this up for 99 cents. Pretty good deal. Used to belong to Jimmy Jr. For 99 cents, picked up a 3DS charger. Which is awesome because, uh, you know, everybody's always looking for one of these. And then in that same bin, there was a uh, Sony PlayStation 2 Slim uh, power cable. I don't know why they made these. Well, I guess I, I know why they made it different. Because you slim models, you couldn't put the uh, power source on the inside of the console. But, yeah, so it was $1.99. And then I found the second part to it. And they wanted $0.99 cents for it. But uh, I told her that they go together. So she just charged me the $1.99. So for two bucks, picked up a, a Sony brand power cable for a PS2 Slim. 
which was pretty cool. Hit up our thrift store where they always have like good video game stuff. They didn't really have any good video games today, but uh, we did find this in the toy section for 90 cents. It is the uh, Bowser Mario Kart. Now I believe this came from the uh, McDonald's toy line, came from the Happy Meal. There's so many stickers are on there. Have to take that little sticker on the bottom off. I might just leave it on there, but uh, Bowser will get a spot up there. Then I found this really cool little bag of toys. It was $1.50. I'll just open it now. But uh, there's an Angry Bird in there. There's a couple of these, uh, I think they're Bakugan guys. Don't really care about those. There's uh, one of these guys. Don't know what that is. Don't care. There's one of these green things. I'm not sure what that is. Don't care about that either. But I basically paid a dollar fifty, so I could get uh, this little Magic Koopa. So I figured that was pretty cool. It says Bishop on there, so this is probably from the uh, Mario Chess set. And uh, we'll give him a little spot in the game room somewhere, maybe like right there. So yeah, just a dollar fifty for that little figure. Um, and then Carol Ann, who's been going through a yo-yo phase. So I found for $2.50 this whole bag of yo-yos for her to play with. She's actually sitting right over there right now because she wants me to give her this bag so she can go play with them. Do you want to say hi to everybody? I'm small. <laughs> Hold on. Hello. <laughs> All right, here's your yo-yos. Skedaddle. All right. So I did pick up two Big giant bags of Skylanders. We'll look at those um, at the end. But they had some games in their game bin. And, uh, you know, whatever. They had the blue tag on them. I said, they don't have any prices on them. They're like $1.50. So I definitely took them for $1.50. First one is uh, Wii Game Party. Which is good to have these games, you know, so you can bundle them with consoles and stuff like that. We got Skylanders. Swap Force. Like I said, I picked up a whole couple I had two big bags really of Skylanders that uh, I'll show at the end and then uh, Skylanders Giants both of those for the 360 so there is that let's get some more stuff okay so um, the next place I went it's a little thrift store it's um, Volunteers of America I hardly ever go there they didn't really have anything uh, but I was walking through the toy aisle and I saw this it's a Wii Fit Plus board Normally, you should just pass on these because nobody wants them. But I got it for such a good price. It was $3.93. It's all in there. Now, the uh, battery compartment does have a little rust. So we'll try and get that out of there. A little corrosion. We'll try and get that out of there as best we can. I think it'll work, though. And, um, yeah, since it's New Year's, I figure people will be making those dumb New Year's resolutions where they want to... Where they want to lose weight and they're like well we'll do we'll do we fit you know so hopefully we can sell that they did have um we fit the game but just like last week with all those psp cases there wasn't a game in there so she just gave me the uh the case and manual for free so if we ever come across the loose disc we'll just throw it in there but uh i knew i was gonna go to half price books and in their their clearance bin for two dollars picked up a copy of we fit that one's complete Really nice shape. And then later on in the day, I picked up at Goodwill uh, We Fit Plus. I think this was uh, $1.99 or $2.99. So what we're going to do is it looks like we're going to have about four, about $10 invested into this whole We Fitness uh, kit and caboodle thing here. So we'll throw it up on Craigslist for uh, 30 bucks, And the first person to offer us like 20 or 25 we'll just dump it. Um, not a great profit margin, but every little bit helps. So, all right, let's grab some more stuff. All right, so uh, we went to a brand new thrift store. I think it was Family Thrift or Ohio Thrift or whatever. And uh, we were in there last week, but I didn't actually buy this, and I knew they had one in there. So I rushed in, made sure I stopped by there today after we picked up our two giant bags of Skylanders. And for $1.99, and then it was 20% uh, off, so it was like $1.60, picked up a portal for Skylanders. You guys, I'm just going to bundle all them Skylanders together and, and sell them. So that's what we're going to do with that. Been having some pretty good luck with some uh, Guitar Hero uh, guitars in my area. So anytime I see one that's uh, sort of unique 
or a little bit different. I'm going to go ahead and pick it up. Like I sold that Fallout Boy one, um, which was really cool. And then uh, my son actually picked up one of these a while back. It's a, a wired Xbox 360 uh, Guitar Hero guitar. I forget the name of the actual guitar. Got that for $6. And uh, like I said, it's, uh, it's wired, so it's, uh, you know, USB. And it uh, looks like these bad boys are going for $25, $30. Bucks. Got it for $6. Bucks. I'm going to throw it up on Craigslist, see if I can get a quick 20 out of it and uh, get rid of it. So picked up another guitar hero just can't stay away from them and i tell you what when you're out there and you're like finding games and like useful stuff for your collection you don't even give guitar heroes like a, a second thought at least i don't but when the pickings are slim and you got to resort to buying stuff to resell why not you guys also saw this in the video this is pretty cool i'd never seen one of these before i didn't actually even know they existed but uh, saw this at goodwill paid a little bit of money for it uh, it was 13 dollars but again, I think they go for about 30 online. So the, the first person to offer me like 20 or 25 bucks, definitely going to get it. It is the uh, Rock Band 3 keyboard, which looks like somebody put the letters <laughs> on the individual keys, which is crazy. It's um, complete. It's got the dongle and the, uh, the little strap and the instructions and everything else that's supposed to go in there. So yeah, pretty, uh, pretty interesting. I don't know if it's a keyboard or a keytar or whatever the actual uh, name of that is. But, yeah, so we'll uh, throw that up there so you guys can gander at it and oogle, oogle it and Google it. All right, let's get to these big-ass bags of Skylanders. All right, so first thrift store of the day, guys, I go in there and um, I always like to buy something there. That way you don't get shut out for the day. And um, we've been having some really good luck there with some, you know, this is where they had like the 75 cent games. Now they're, you know, $1.25. It's where I found my Pikachu N64, uh, my Aurora Activator, or Actu Inter Interactor, I'm sorry. And uh, the big box of Bionicles from last time. So we, we generally have good luck there because we're the first ones there. And uh, I saw this in the cart that they were using to put stuff out on the shelf. So for $5 each, we picked up these two giant bags of uh, Skylanders. Now, I don't really know a lot about Skylanders. I normally wouldn't mess with Skylanders, but I knew for $5, the amount of uh, figures in these bags was definitely worth it. So we're just going to rip through these real quick, and you guys can let me know if there's any uh, any rare ones or anything like that in there. All right. So the first one is, uh, this chick's pretty cool. Got that one. Got uh, that thing. That's pretty awesome. That chick's pretty sweet. Got a cannon. Is that that trigger? Is that that guy's name? It's, uh, that guy. That guy looks pretty cool. big shark guy i think that's from the skylanders giants that's the only series i know is because they got orange bottoms back there got uh one of those looks like a blue one um one of those things maybe a second one of those that guy That too looks like a scorpion. That's pretty sweet. Looks like a hammer. Thor's hammer. It's probably not what it is, but it's cool. So we got uh, Disney Infinities in there. Captain Jack Sparrow. It's pretty exciting. Is it Spyro? I don't know. It's a dragon that looks like Spyro. Got one of these things, but it's green. Got that guy. It's pretty exciting. Oh, that one looks pretty cool. I bet you that's rare. It's pretty cool. It's a lady spyro. Um, I don't know these go to all oh, they got magnets on the bottom, so these might go to these. Yep. 
that's pretty cool. There's another one that's a magnet on the bottom guy person. I hope they're all in here then. Got Mike Wazowski. The Disney Infinity. Got one of these. Uh, that's pretty sweet. Got that. Got that guy. Got this little bird guy, which goes to that. There we go. Sweet. That's it for that bag. We got uh, the shark dude, which is pretty sweet. And then last but not least, we got uh, this thing. All right, that was one of the bags, guys. That was crazy. So here's the other bag. We'll go ahead and open that up. Again, five bucks per bag. You know, you're not going to pass that up. That's just too good of a deal. All right, so we got, well, that's pretty sweet looking. Got this big dude with a pumpkin head. Piece for one of these other magnety things. It's another magnet person thing. Oh, I know this guy's name. This is Swarm. Because my son, I think, has one of these. From Skylanders Giants. Got Sully from Disney Infinity. Which I'm sure those aren't worth anything. His little pirate guy goes to one of these. Probably goes like that. Got that dude. That's pretty awesome. This dude looks like he's got a beehive gun. Another one of those pieces. Were those like swap force or trap team or something? All right, it looks like a building of some kind. This person's got a tank. That's pretty cool. Another Skylanders giant. Another Skylanders giant. Guy's got a cool pose. Oh, it looks like a Disney Infinity thing there. That's pretty cool. Big turtle razorback looking thingy. That's pretty sweet. Little diamond. Another little turtle thing. That's pretty cool. And the last piece in here, guys. Oh, I'm sorry. There's cheese all over the place. Okay, the bag's empty. But there's uh, two more tops for, what is it, like Swap Force or Swap Team or whatever. So there's two more of those in there. And as you can see, that is a bunch of Skylanders for 10 bucks. I'll bundle that with the portal, with the games. And uh, we'll start to look these up, see if there's any rare ones in there. Guys, that is going to do it. Thank you for sticking around for this episode. Um, if you're interested in any of these Skylanders or anything like that, let me know if I still have them. So, like I said, thanks for stopping by, guys, and we will see you on the next one.